five days. You haven't left the house in five days. I have a medical condition. Being? Legs. Uh, Mr... Lee. Mr. Lee, do you know this man? Yes. Why? He's missing. Well, that's not very good. Been five days now. Any leads? And her? Missing. Four days. What a sad state of affairs. Can you see where this is going? Three. Are you hungry? <laughs> what? I'm ravenous. I mean, I, I can wait if you... Good. Investigating. Oh, did you break in? Why would I break in? To get in. He let me through the front door. He. You. Uh, you. Stay there. Stay right there. You two. Oh, come on. Come over here. We've got something to show you. We. Different we. Come and have a look. Back. I'm not going nowhere.
Where is it? Where do you put it? Yes, you can. Just point. I'm not doing it. I'm not. Tell me where it is, you can't make me live like this. I've had a long morning. What's the point? Why aren't you in school? It's Saturday. Should have said. Well, why aren't you at work? It's a Saturday? Oh, fuck. And I was yelling, stop, 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 but it was too late. So now I need to get a new one, fast. But the pet store wouldn't give me a trading discount. I was gonna call the police, actually. The owner's coming to pick it up tomorrow, so I'd try, I've tried to prop it up on the sofa, but... Is that all? Not even. The legs are going all different directions. This looks ridiculous. Doesn't look that bad from a distance, actually. What's in your pocket? That was already mine. It's cold. You don't know that. It's dripping. Uh, slap Mercy, I'll see you later. You could just pay for it. Uh, can I help you? Yes. You know, I can't seem to remember. Okay. Exactly. Well, places to be. You can't keep me here forever. No, really, feel, feel free to, to leave. Where did you hide it? Why do you keep bringing this up? So we can all know the truth. I'm not going to admit it. Wait, what? What? So there is something to admit? No, I just mean that... The... Just say it. Noah! Uh... Say it! She's not adopted. I'll get my answers.
nearly died today. Elaborate. Well, I was out mowing the lawn, right? And the thing got all clogged up with grass. You know how it does. So I took the back off, thinking maybe I could just pull it all out. So I reached in and grabbed a big handful of wet grass, and that was fine. Reached in again, a bit further, got a bit more out. It's fine, it still wouldn't start. So, went in for a third time, I was really wrangling with the thing, and then... So, who were you this morning, Mercy? No, you weren't. I'm worried about you. You can talk to us, you know. We're the boys, the lads. The adopted family. Not that one. The squad. <laughs> Please never say that again. Then tell us what you've been up to. Uh, new job. Paper round. Gotta get them out early. Why lie? Why ask? Thanks for dinner. Are you sure? You're gonna get me fired. Try and stop me. I literally did. You know you left the shop unattended. All day. Yeah, you're going to get you fired. Pest. Did you know Bowie's still alive? And Diana. Uh, and Elvis. Tupac. Biggie. Um, Doris Day. Right. Have a good night, yeah? No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so this is the earth, yeah? I need you to say it. Say it. Yup. Okay, this is the island. You've lost me. Okay, so they fight their own deaths and they go to the island. Diana started first, so. Elvis died first. They didn't die. Jackson, what did you do all day? I robbed your shop, I, I guess. Um, I don't know, nothing much. Yeah. It used to be a lot easier to dream. You know, when we were in school, it felt like we could be anything once we weren't stuck here. But we're done now. We're free to live our lives. And I feel more stuck than ever. I used to really want to make my parents proud. I don't know if that's weird. I mean, I just felt like one day that would make me happy. But I never really thought about how, so here I am. Not even proud of myself. I spent so long thinking about the future. I forgot to make it happen. Isn't this meant to be the time of our lives? 
I think that one might be on us. to dad about moving out. I mean, we can't stay here. We? Well, okay, me. But figured you'd come with. I mean, what else are you gonna do? Just live here with him? What are you doing with your life, Mercy? I'm in school, I have friends. You just work in the shop down the road. Why won't you tell me what you do? Look, I'm sorry you don't have a place with us anymore. And I'm sorry you find this family difficult. But life isn't just hard for you. Get a job. Get yourself out. Yeah. Sure. I love you.
Why do you know where I live? You wrote it on your knife collection. That was a bad idea. Give it back. No. Yes. It's in the lake. What? Bye. Wait. Can we come in? Heath wants something. I'd like a snack of water. Please. Water. Then I saw your box of food. <laughs> Fridge. Sure. So, you live here? Y yes. <laughs> ah, <laughs> say, what would it take for you? to let us live here. I'm sorry? Well, we're sort of looking for somewhere to stay right now. We're moderately homeless. And he can't be out in the dark. <laughs> you literally arrived in the dark. It's a recent development. <laughs> you, you can't live here. I live here. There's room for three. There's three already. Six then. Five. Three. Done. Oh. Look, I won't lie to you. We just really need somewhere to stay right now. It's been a long week. Right. I get it. Whatever. Okay, look, I'm not saying you can stay here. But right now, I really need help with something and... I don't know who else to ask. Help me. Show us to our rooms. Has she built it right? I mean, it is on. Oh, it just looks incredibly dangerous. Hmm. How has the day gone so wrong? Life is cruel. Help me find them. You're very invested in this, aren't you? Just to be clear, what was your plan here? I was gonna go in. Don't do that. What's to be scared of? Well, you either know or you don't. And you do know. Both of you. There you go then. Don't go in. But they're in there. Of course they're in there. There are people going missing every day around here. Every single day. And no one cares. No one wants to care. Bad things just happen. Life goes on. Yeah, I mean, that's probably a good way to look at it's it. It's a terrible way of looking at it. You making there sound like literal hell. Is that it? Is it literally hell? Yes. Then how can you let it happen? Look, as far as we know, this Right here is the only point of connection to that place that exists. If we take it away, take it apart, all of this can stop. No one has to go missing ever again. That's not answering my question. If you close this, this gateway, whatever it is, then they're gone for good. I mean, I didn't actually say... I'm not... Stupid. We need to help because they need our help. And not just help, our help. Because we're already standing at, at the gates to hell. We get to decide whether we do what we can, futile or not, because it's right. Because 
We're right here. We're the ones who can. It doesn't matter that we had nothing to do with it. That they were taken in there for God knows what, with no consideration of humanity or torment. All for the everyone else, waiting on the outside, wondering where the people we loved have gone. It doesn't matter that we didn't do it, because we'll be the ones who locked them in, who had the moment and let it slip away. We get to decide if we'll do what must be done. And I've already made up my mind.